this is a video to document the roach infestation in Wainani F building, apartment 1103. I just wanted you guys to see this. Um, the echo labs thing really didn't do anything that you guys did for us, at least in our room. I wanted to show you the extent of the infestation and we're relatively clean people. Um, I had to take out every single one of the drawers open up every one of the cupboards, remove the refrigerator, and basically use a whole bottle of my own traps and sprays and everything else um, that could possibly kill a roach. Um, and the result is these roaches are hiding up in those areas um, of the shelves and the kitchen underneath the kitchen counter. Um, everywhere there's a crack. Um, unfilled spaces are everywhere. Roaches pour through them. When I was spraying up in here with the roach killer stuff, they were running out like I just shook a bee's nest. Um, hundreds of them. Um, the document some of the bodies. There's bodies everywhere. Those are roaches, roach bodies. Um, every one of those specks down there is another roach. They go everywhere. There, more there, more there. Even up near our dishes, they've been crawling all over our dishes. Um, behind the refrigerator, all the other things, those are all roaches. Every speck you basically see down there is a roach. Um, they're underneath our refrigerator, corners. Um, oh, that's roach feces. They were up in there. In fact, you can probably almost see a live roach right there. Again, they were up in here. Oh, there's more roaches. I'll take you around the other side now. Oh, there's a roach there behind our microwave. And onto the carpet next. There's a dead roach on the carpet. Oh, another one there. Um, again, that's where they are. They're hiding in that crevice right there. And we'll move down. Capture some more dead bodies. There's more there. There's more there. There. Um, there's lots on the couch as well. Um, oh, there's one still kind of kicking right there. Oh, it looks like he might come back alive. Um, again, they're underneath here. Underneath there, going all the way down to the door. Um, and they're running towards the rooms, um, all over the place. Basically, I don't understand what student services and the building managers are doing to prevent this. Echo Labs come and they spray for two seconds and they leave. Nothing is being done. They're still alive. We've had to spend you know roughly thirty dollars plus of our own money to try to clean this place we've kept it spotless for the last two months now i mean spotless to the point where every time we even drop a crumb we wipe it up with a paper towel and it is still like this uh... had it with sandy you know it's bad with these roaches climbing all over your dishes and plates and you get salmonella and e coli and you know they spread it all all sorts of diseases and again up in these cupboards that's all roach digging in and out of the cardboard and or the walls and making homes and nests um, you know uh, I've had to put those fake traps or the not fake but the black traps all over the place I think I probably put about eight of them in here um, basically the only thing they're not really in right now oh there's one crawling on our pan there it goes um, is our refrigerator but I have a feeling that might soon change. Anyways, I hope that you guys can do more for this. Um, there's dead stuff all in the drawers, wings, and other bodies, and I mean that's that's all dead parts and pieces of them. That's oh, you can't quite see it, but there are a bunch of dead in there. Uh, oh, oops, there's dead roaches there. Oh, there's one right there. Oh, 
I don't understand uh, how you guys can expect to even have anyone living in conditions like this. Uh, I've lived in Hawaii for the last five years, multiple places, um, and this is absolutely appalling. Uh, you know, I almost want to just start a lawsuit. This is so bad. This is uh, ridiculous, especially when people were this clean, and it's still this bad. Anyways, I thought you should be aware of these conditions. Uh, again, uh, or first time, my name's Cody Stewart, and thank you.